We felt, as you know, we have a lot of great basketball in the state of North Carolina. And and even if you look at right down the road in Kinston, North Carolina, or you look at Lenore County, you look at Pitt County, one of the things I've heard from high school coaches is how do we, it was better under the last administration as far as coaching staff. How do we improve upon the uh, local coaches? Because we do have a lot of kids that could go to the ACC or the SEC, for example. How do we keep them in the 252 and keep them in Greenville? Well, it's definitely the goal, Dave, uh, without a doubt. And they, when Bubba spoke about what was some of the things that excited me about ECU, that's as much as anything that I think we're in the best prep uh, basketball state in the country or right up there at the very top when it comes to whether it's high school basketball, AAU basketball. And the reason is, is what you just alluded to. I think we have the very best coaches, prep coaches. I know what high school basketball means to this state and what coaching in this state at the high school prep level means. And it's really important and we have great coaches, but as far as us being able to draw that talent and those student athletes to want to stay home at ECU, I think there's a, a couple things. Number one, we have to do our job uh, in this program and we have to set this program to a standard where those kids want to stay home and they're excited to come to ECU. What I'll be at the success of the program winning, uh, building a program that competes at the top of the American conference and, and player development, and that's something we really strive to do is player development. I mean, you guys know my philosophy is to recruit high school kids and want to bring kids in and develop them. And so player development is something that's going to be really key for us and to see the progress of some of these young guys to their sophomore year, junior year, and into their graduating years that the kids locally say, that's what I want to be a part of because every kid wants to come to college wherever they go, and they know they want to get better during that time there. So we have to put that product out there, a winning product, a development product, player development on the court, off the court. And then the flip and the next piece is the relationships that we do have with the high school coaches in the area. Uh, I've had a chance to go to South Central High School, go to Kinston High School, go to Farmville Central High School, meet all those coaches. We've been to Raleigh several times and we've hit as many and met as many coaches as we can that we didn't know or guys we did know and visit with them multiple times. We've had coaches and invited coaches and local prospects to our campus, and they've taken advantage since we've been here in April. So I think that's, uh, I don't know if it'll happen overnight, but I think we're making a real emphasis to recruit the Eastern part of this state, but also this state as a whole. And if both sides come to a good balance, I think we will keep kids home and that's what we want to do.